Hello everyone, my name is uh, Samuel Martins. Uh, I belong to the University of Porto, to the, the learning team from the University of Porto. Um, first of all, let me thank you on behalf of all the team that works in the, in the EDUCOS project. Let me thank you uh, uh, about the, 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 um, the UNIS award uh, uh, that, you, that you gave us to us. It was, we are very happy with that. Uh, we are very excited because uh, bes besides the, the, the recognition of the, of the work that we have implemented over the years, uh, we are very very proud to be to be uh, to be receiving this award from Eunice because we we love the spirit of you of the Eunice and uh, we think it is uh, it is uh, the ideals that are behind of, of Eunice are the, the the ideals that make sense to all the people that works in the higher education and works with collaboration and so uh, once again thank you very much for the award we are very excited and uh, and uh, let me also apologize for not being present physically over there but it was not possible and uh, so let me let me let me start with this presentation uh, and, and once again thank you for for your for your recognition so this uh, this presentation regarding the the, the educast project uh, I'm going to talk about a, a little bit of the project, what it is the, that project, and all the evolution over over the, the last the last uh, the last years. So first of all, let me let me say that the the, the Educast project has two big frameworks that uh, that uh, that uh, manages the the, the 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 project. And so for 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 this project, uh, the one of the the big the big frameworks of this project is the technological aspect of this and so first of all it is a, it is a platform it is a platform for for production for editing and video distribution and gives a full a good autonomy to the to the user in all the in all the the, the, the process <coughs> Other, another framework of this of this project is the the people's uh, the people's um, role in this in this in this project and so uh, one of the main characteristics of this project is the, the the integration of all the people that works in this project in the in the in the professional structure and that professional structure supports all the the, the, the production of the, of the of the of the content of the video content and uh, this gives a good a good base to all of the of the project and to all of the of uh, of the work <coughs> And so, why this is a, a we consider an, a, an an innovative project? First of all, because of the uh, of the adaptation of the technology that uh, that was made over the, in the beginning of the project and uh, over uh, over the years. This pro this project this uh, platform is from Switch in the in the Switzerland, and so um, originally from Switch from the Switch uh, organization. And it's, uh, uh, it was made mainly to the, the Swiss higher education environment and so has some kind of characteristics that are most adaptable to, to, that, uh, to that environment. But the Portuguese NRN, FCCN, made the adaptation of the technology in conjunction, in, in, the, in collaboration with, uh, with the, the switch, uh, made the adaptation of the technology to the, the Portuguese higher, uh, higher education environment. So because there is some kind of difference, and so it is important to make that kind of uh, that, to make that kind of um, adaptation. And so how it works? Uh, how did it works over the years? First of all, in 2009, it was the first contact over the the, 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 the several meetings that the Terena made mainly in the TF Media work, uh, uh, group works and uh, the several workshops of lecture recording that uh, that was were made uh, over the Terena oversight. And then it it was born the the, the FCCN and Switch uh, uh, partnership. Um, uh, after that, after that, in 2010, it was made, it was implemented the the, the, the pilot project, uh, and uh, uh, it born the, the the partnership between FCCN and University of Porto. University of Porto here was a strategic partner because it gives it gives it gave and it gives also. 
um, the, the pedagogical uh, structure, the, the training of the people, and free the FCCN to, to focus on the technological aspects of the, of the, of the project. And uh, in 2011, it was implemented a full service to, uh, to all the country in Portugal. And so, University of Porto maintained the, 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 the partnership, be, being the, the strategic partnership, uh, making, making the training of, of all the teams in Portugal, making the, 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 the structure of courses, the, make the, the, the structure of, of, of the training in, in Portugal. And uh, even in that year, we, uh, we assist, uh, we, we saw more than 20 institutions uh, gathering and uh, joining together in the, in the project and uh, more than 1000 videos were produced uh, just in that uh, in that in that year <clears throat> one of the of the other big aspects and positive aspects of this project is the the, the network of technicians that uh, is uh, made made and born and uh, and created with this uh, with this project uh, over the years more than 80 people uh, were trained to, to use MCAST uh, with more than 40 hours of training hours and uh, uh, until now, until this year, we have uh, 40 higher education institutions between universities, uh, uh, research labs, many, many uh, um, higher education, uh, many institutions that, um, that uh, feel the need to produce videos, educative, educative uh, videos. Um, Another another uh, innovative aspect that we consider an, uh, an, uh, an uh, in an innovative aspect is the, the the collaboration, mainly the institutional co collaboration between the, the institutions that uh, that uh, were that worked worked together all, all over this this process, and so uh, the spirit of the of the of partnership was was um, so we can we can we co could see, could see could saw this. This uh, this spirit over the years between the the, the, the switch team and the FCCN Portuguese team that work together to make the adaptation of, of the of the technology and then also the, the integration of the University of Porto to help uh, structuring the, the training and uh, structuring the, the courses to the staff to the staff meeting and the giving the the, the, the aspect the, the the necessary knowledge. To, to make the bridge and the connection with the teachers that are ultimately the, the last the, 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 the main producers of the, the video content and all, all, all of this was uh, was possible because of the um, of the activities and the, all the, the, the work that the Terena was made, making all over the years with those workshops with the, 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 the meeting the meetings between teams of several universities uh, and rents all over the all over Europe. And so it was possible to disseminate and to implement in Portugal uh, all this this work, all this this service, and to create impact uh, in all the 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 the, the high education uh, network. Um, another asp important aspect is the the working methods uh, and the management of this uh, of this project uh, as as it still works uh, today. And so. Uh, first of all, the, 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 the workflow. The workflow is very, 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 very good because of the flexibility and uh, the, that it gives to all the to all the teams and the support to the to every teachers and to all the people in each institution that wants to produce videos. And uh, it uh, it creates a good workflow between the all the way between the NREN, FCCN that is ultimately the the owner of the technology. And uh, give the necessary development to that to that uh, to that service to that service, and of course the the ultimate user that is the teacher or the student that makes the production, and so the chain all the chain is covered with a nice workflow that communicates and um, that gives a good support uh, all over the country and all over the the, the Portuguese higher education higher education institutions. So this kind of flexibility and agility is very nice and very nice because it can respond to not only the technical issues but also to the, the pedagogical uh, aspects that uh, sometimes the, the people that work with the, the, the gears and the, the equipment and the technology can give to the, to the teachers and also 
the 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 the, way, the, the other way around. So the teacher must most of the time also must give some kind of input to the technicians so that they can 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 they can adapt the technology and all the equipments to all of this uh, to all of this project to all of this service. And so uh, this structural uh, uh, approach uh, gives gives a good level of qual of quality, uh, ensures a uh, good support, and ultimately it can give uh, can assure some kind of quality to the to the content, and that's very important to to these kind of uh, uh, institutions. And another innovative aspect, and ultimately the most important one. Is the, the the impact, the pedagogical impact that is created in the universities and, of course, in the, the in the pedagogical process. That is the the ultimate goal for uh, the the work of our daily work of our of our teams. And so, this is uh, we think uh, one of the of the main of the main uh, uh, aspects. And so we we think that it can it can improve the management of lectures. Uh, that are traditional less appealing and so it can it can uh, how can I say uh, put in video the more passive the more passive uh, part of the class and free the class to the to the to the interactive part to the mentoring part to the the, the student teacher one-to-one -one, uh, uh, conversation that is very important and uh, in, the, in the in the pedagogical process. And so, um, with this kind of, of work, we think we can create also some 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 attraction to some kind of educational content uh, that traditionally are not so no not not so appealing. And so, uh, we think it's possible uh, uh, with that. Um, we can also free the time of of uh, of the teachers so that they can support, uh, interact directly with uh, with uh, with the students. And that's very important because all the passive part of the class is in the video that the student can watch before he goes to the, the class, for example. Um, and uh, of course, the, the 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 main the main the increase of the of the interest of some kind of subjects that traditionally are not so so appealing because of the the nature of that of that of that subject. And so the video can enhance and can improve that uh, that uh, that aspect. So we are uh, <clears throat> we are very very happy with the, the results all over the years the quantitative results mainly because it is the results that we can we can measure and so in the last in the last years we are seeing an increasing of the institutions that are using this this service in this project and like I said before we now have uh, almost 40 institutions that are producing videos with uh, <clears throat> with Educast and also we have uh, a nice uh, number of videos created and so so far we have more than 6000 videos produced produced by by the, the people the, the 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 content producers in each institutions and so we can see that we are um, viewing some some great uh, great growth in the in the in the production another aspect the interesting aspect is that the areas of the the of the of the videos, so we can see in this graphic the the main areas of the of the of the video. So uh, and uh, one of the the ideas that w that we are uh, that you are we are seeing is that those areas like technology that are traditionally more uh, suitable and uh, more uh, they like more to produce videos are not necessarily the areas that are producing more videos. So we are seeing areas that traditionally are not uh, uh, are not connected to technology, not connected to video. They are producing a lot of videos, and so we are creating here a nice a nice uh, change in this uh, in this uh, way of of uh, of work. <coughs> and. Um, about the, the the technological about the technological aspects of the of the of the platform and the, and the service, uh, it's important to say that uh, it needs 
uh, uh, less uh, uh, less equipment. Uh, we don't need much much equipment to do this uh, this kind of production. This is in this image. This is the the basic equipment to make an educast production. A basic a basic educast production. We can do it uh, even with less equipment. But this is the the optimal situation to to make a good. Uh, a good uh, educast, uh, educast production. We have a PC, a computer, a Mac in this case, uh, a camera, uh, mi a wireless microphone, and then a, 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 a device, the Epifan device, to have these two signals to, so that we can have not only the video like you are seeing now, my, my video, and from, the, from this side, I think you are seeing from this side, the, 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 computer, the computer signal and uh, the PowerPoint, for example, that the teacher is, is showing in the, in, the, in the class. And so this gives a great portability of equipment. Being less equipment and being, being so, much, so little equipment, uh, it gives portability. The, the, the teacher, the, the staff can move the equipment around the, 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 the campus and this gives flexibility, this, give, this gives a good, a good way to, 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 to work. In the beginning of this project we had, you created six uh, uh, kits like, like this one, so with this box so that they can move around the, the, the several universities to, to help push the production and to show to all the, the new universities that, that were joining the, the project how they can, uh, they can prepare and how they can um, set up uh, an equipment to this kind of uh, uh, production. So um, about about the, 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 the this kind this the specifications we, we this project is clearly clearly a, a cloud approach because all the the videos are stored in the Portuguese Niren in Lisbon in the in the FCCN. We they have they have federated authentication um, and also, uh, the, like you you seeing in this this video that that, that you are seeing with this my presentation, uh, we have synchronous content because I'm switching here the the slides and we are seeing the slides switching at the same time, so it's real time synchronization. Um, and so uh, most of the work is made online, so um, uh, all the the process. Of, of recording, of course, is made is made in the in the in the room where the teacher is giving the class. But after the recording process, all the work is made uh, online. So we can give, we can make the 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 um, the editing. We can make the publishing of the video. We can add metadata to the video online, in other computer at home when he when he arrives home at night. So this gives a, a great autonomy. To the teacher, to the people that are making the the, the, the production, the production, and so the uh, also the, the the recording process and the, the interface is very simple because we are talking about a, a public that is not necessarily prepared to make a video editing, and so they don't need the big video production software. They need only the basics, and so uh, this uh, this uh, simple interface can also uh, help. To 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 uh, to to achieve and to 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 reach this kind of, of audience. So uh, this this project and this service it's very important because it can it can uh, um, reach all the process of the video production from the recording process to the publishing process. And so uh, for the first time we have uh, a service that can. Uh, reach all this this process. It's one of the, the main issues when when we are talking about video production is the the possibility to uh, access equipment, then access software to make edition, and then access uh, equipment to to make to make the, um, the the not only the edition but to have to have storage and then the uh, uh, place to put the video and publish the video so sometimes it's very difficult to arrange this kind all these ca these characteristics and have an integrated and complete service and with, with the educast we can reach all this uh, all this way from the recording testing with the upload of the video and editing the video also online and publishing the video so all this this path is covered and that's very important to uh, to the user and to a, a content producer 
that has no time and that has that wants to to make a, um, a faster process in the make in the video production <coughs> and then uh, so this is, this is um, an example of the, of the of the interface so simple very simple interface a big button to record a big button to, to stop just one of two buttons to to configure the sound the microphone to choose the, the microphone so it's very simple very simple and uh, it's possible to to create different channels also so the teacher can have different channels according to uh, to their curricular unit or according to their their organization of the of the of the disciplines and the, and the, their their training and so um, this kind of channels with uh, these different channels that he can create can as can also have access different access levels and so this gives a good a good uh, uh, flexibility to, to the teacher and also the the online editing like I said before after he made the recording all the process is online so even the 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 the, the editing part is made online and so we can create video clips from from the from the video, add some 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 metadata, add some some imp, little image of about uh, that can also uh, help identify the video, like the the school logo for 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 example, and also has the possibility of publishing the video, and so he has uh, some 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 possibilities to integrate the video in the in the in the LMS. Uh, curricular units for example in Moodle and Blackboard um, and he has he has uh, mainly three uh, three formats that can uh, can uh, make available the the, um, the video one of these formats is the the like the the, the iPod format that we we are seeing uh, uh, below that is also a, um, a format that is well best suited to, to the to the to smartphones to iPads and so uh, this platform this service is adapted to all of the, these new gadgets that uh, are uh, overwhelming and even more each uh, passing the days we are uh, we are having each mo much much more of those those equipments and so it's very important to have a format that is adapted to the to the mobile to the mobile uh, equipments. And so uh, um, uh, let uh, I'd like to to finish just saying that uh, once again that uh, this this project uh, uh, we see we we think it's a good example of the best European ideals and we we'd like we we'd like to we are very happy to show this in in Eunice because it is, I think it is the the best place to 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 show it because of this these uh, great European uh, ideals because of the technological synergies that we that we saw that we saw in the in the beginning of the of, of the my of the, my presentations but also the, the the synergies between the peoples the different staffs in Europe but also the different staffs in Portugal this project it made possible to get to get to, to together uh, um, a group of people, of technicians, of, of people with know-how in this in this matter, and they are all working together and contaminating their set, or, uh, between them the, the best practices of of the of the content uh, of the audiovisual content uh, uh, produce um, production and elevating the quality uh, and maintaining a good quality and the, the, the of the of the blended learning and de-learning. Uh, production concerning to the the audiovisual uh, to audiovisual uh, production in that's very very important this this network this networking of of uh, collaboration and uh, and also helping each each other because uh, uh, with this community all the people are working to, are are talking together and they are improving their skills uh, okay they are improving their their knowledge in this in this area and they are contaminating themselves, and all the, the, the institutions are also um, are also maintaining a good quality in the, the production, and uh, with also a, a good scale and a good critical mass that can that can uh, support the teachers and all the students uh, in their daily daily lives, and also like we saw before. 
uh, it is a project that communicates in practical, practical result, results for the academic communities. You saw in the numbers that I showed before that is a huge impact, and we not we not analyze uh, in detail the the quality of results. Probably in the future we can make some kind of research to see the impact. Uh, in, the, in the daily lives of these of these teachers and in the, in the students, but the quantitative results that we can measure automatically and very fast, we can see we can so we could saw in that in that uh, in that results that are creating a huge a huge um, impact. So let me thank you once again for for your time. Thank you so much for your for your recognition for your award and for your for your. Uh, recognition uh, with with our work with, with us um, once again I'm sorry for not being here and all the team not being here but I think we are very well represented by uh, Ligia Ribeiro from the University of Porto that is one of that is one of the main the, the main supporters from the first hour of this project he has also the, the she has also the the, the vision of this uh, of this project and so without her it was not possible even to think about this this project and and implement this project so uh, thank you so much to her uh, also and uh, once again thank you for much for your recognition and i hope to see you next year um, in the next in the next congress thank you so much